especially after the losses, and I'm sure they are more than willing to do just that in our match at hand as we get back to this game. What a block by Honey Toring. Honey Toring was there at the right time, and that's enough for the UP squad to call a time out. Because um, once you get that pass, everything else will flow. And of course, constant communication is going to be key here for the Fighting Maroons. And another great block this time by Kate Santiago. Wow, Kate Santiago with that block. And, you know, we were talking about this before the game started, how Adamson... It is a 5-0 to zero run for the Adamson Lady Falcons to welcome us here in set number one. Here comes Encarnacion and the blocking continues for the Lady Falcons. And now we're seeing UP getting a taste of their own medicine. Right, well, I think the UP squad is going to have to outsmart the blockers here for the Fighting Maroons. We see Louis Romero, or we saw her a while back on your screens, trying to get that breather. I mean, oh. this Adamson squad, the Jana said in the pregame that they were pretty upset with their, with their match against the Lady Spikers. It is 18 serving 24, and UP climbed or climbing that hill. It's still alive, they're not giving up just yet. Here come the Adamson Lady Falcons. Alcantara to Honey Toring. Picked up by Bustrillo. Bertolano. Alcantara. Tonique. She's blocked. Alcantara with a one to play. No good. Bertolano. Ball is still alive. Oh. And what a way. Malita and <laughs> set number one for both our teams. And you know. We got a credit, of course, Adams and Lady Falcons. They fought hard for this set. They were dominant from the start. Definitely. But what about the UP fighting Maroons? And they ended the set smiling and laughing. 